Have you ever sat down to wonder what clubs have the most Ballon d'Or wins? Well, wonder no more because we're bringing you that list today. And mind you, this is not a list of clubs with the most Ballon d'Or winning players. It's a list of 10 clubs with the highest number of Ballon d'Or victories. You'll be shocked by who's in number three. In number 10 is a bunch of clubs who have had one Ballon d'Or win each. You have Ajax, Blackpool, Liverpool, Marseille, Dukla Prague, Dinamo Moscow, Ferenc Varos, Borussia Mönchengladbach, Benfica, PSG, and of course, Inter Miami, the first non-European club to produce a Ballon d'Or win. Now, we know that Lionel Messi is responsible for both PSG and Inter Miami being on the list, but who can tell us the only Ajax player to have ever won the Ballon d'Or? Go ahead and take a shot at it in the comments. We'll see if you're correct later in the video. Anyway, in number 9 is German club Hamburger SV with two Ballon d'Or wins, but it is one man who's responsible for both of them, English forward Kevin Keegan. He played for Hamburg for three years between 1977 and 1980, and during that period, he won the Ballon d'Or twice in 1978 and 79. Also with two Ballon d'Or wins is Inter Milan. The Italian giants produced two Ballon d'Or winners in the 90s, Lothar Mateus in 1990 and then of course Ronaldo Nazario who won it in 1997, the year he joined the club. But of course Inter Milan are nowhere close to being the most successful Italian club judging by the Ballon d'Or. We'll find out which Serie A clubs boast more wins later on in this video, but for now let's look at another club with two Ballon d'Or victories. It's Dinamo Kiev. The Ukrainian club has produced two Ballon d'Or winners, Oleg Blokin in 1975 and Igor Belanov in 1986. At number six is Manchester United with four Ballon d'Or victories to their name. Of course, you know Cristiano Ronaldo won the prestigious award while still at Man United in 2008, but can you name the other three Man United players who won the Ballon d'Or? Let's see the real football fans in the comments. By the way, earlier we asked you guys to tell us the only Ajax players who have won the Ballon d'Or. If you said Johan Cruyff, then you are very correct. Now to the top five. Bayern Munich have produced five Ballon d'Or wins in their history. Gerd Müller won it in 1970, Franz Beckenbauer won it in 1972 and 1976, and Karl-Heinz Rummenigge won it in 1980 and 81. It could easily have been six with Robert Lewandowski in 2020, but France football decided not to give the award that year. Tough luck. Anyway, at number four is AC Milan, one of the most successful clubs in European football history. So it's actually no surprise that they can boast of having produced Ballon d'Or winners in eight different years. Crazy. Gianni Rivera won it in 1969, Ruud Hullet in 1987, then you have Marco Van Basten winning it in 88, 89 and 92, then George Ware won it in 1995 becoming the first non-European to win the award and that was the last time Milan produced a Ballon d'Or winner in the 90s. But nine years later, they were back, with Andriy Shevchenko going home with the golden ball. And three years later, Kaká won it in a fashion which looked to have introduced the beginning of the Messi and Ronaldo era. But Milan are not alone on eight. Their fierce rivals Juventus can also boast eight Ballon d'Or wins. Omar Sivori won the Ballon d'Or in 1961. Paolo Rossi won it in 1982, then handed the baton to Michel Platini, who went on a three-year run. He became the first player to win the Ballon d'Or three times in a row, and Juventus became the first club to produce Ballon d'Or winners in four consecutive years a record Barcelona would go on to equal. In the 90s, Juve were back at it again. They had Roberto Baggio, who won the award in 1993, and of course, Zinedine Zidane, who won it in 1998 after a successful World Cup campaign. The old lady didn't relent in the 21st century, producing one rather unpopular winner in 2003, Pavel Nedved. Now, the two most successful Ballon d'Or clubs are exactly who you'd expect them to be, but before we talk about them, let's give you the answer to our pop quiz. The other three Man United players to have won the Ballon d'Or are Dennis Law, 1964, Sir Bobby Charlton, 1966, and George Best, 1968. Now, on to those two clubs, Real Madrid and Barcelona, who are tied at the top with 12. Of course, you know Cristiano Ronaldo is responsible for four of the 12 for Real Madrid, and then you have Luka Modric, who won it in 2018, and Karim Benzema, who won it in 2022. But before all these guys was Alfredo Di Stefano, who was the first Madrid player to win the Ballon d'Or. He won it in 1957 and 1959. He also won the Super Ballon d'Or in 1989. He remains the only player to have won that award thus far. Raymond Copa won the Ballon d'Or in 1958. Fabio Cannavaro won it in 2006 
1996 after a successful World Cup outing with Italy and Ronaldo Nazario won it in 2002, also after a successful World Cup for Brazil, then the one that'll forever hurt Barcelona fans, Luis Figo winning it in 2000 as a Real Madrid player, but in actual fact, he was getting rewarded for what he did as a Barca player the previous season. But in spite of that, Barcelona are still joint top. Of course, Lionel Messi is responsible for half a dozen of those, also helping Barcelona equal Juventus's record for the club with the most consecutive Ballon d'Or wins. The other Barcelona players who have won the Ballon d'Or are Luis Suarez. No, not the Uruguayan. There's another player named Luis Suarez who played for Barca back in the day. He is Spanish and he was the first Barcelona player to win the Ballon d'Or, clinching the award in 1960. Johan Cruyff then won it in 1973 and 74, Christo Stoichkov in 1994, Rivaldo in 99 and Ronaldinho in 2005. But Barcelona can boast of also producing the most Ballon d'Or Feminin winners. Since the award was first given out in 2018, Barca have produced the winner on three occasions, Alexia Puteas in 2021 and 2022 and Aitana Bonmati in 2023. That surely is something to be proud of. Anyway, how many Ballon d'Or wins can your favourite team boast of? Tell us in the comments. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Also, turn on the bell notification so you never miss out on new content and we'll catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.